Okay, this is Megan. Megan has had some TMJ problems for about how long? About a couple of years. And what was it like? Like, what kind of pain were you having with it? Um, a different it was like dull, and it would hurt to open my jaw pretty far at all. Clicking. Clicking. He yes. Headache. Yes. Yeah. So lots of stuff there, and TMJ can be very miserable when you have that condition. And what happens is. The jaw, the way that the jaw tracks and moves back and forth is off. And so when that happens, it puts a lot of stress on the joint, which is like real close to your ear. And so you can get pain in the side of your head and get headaches. You can get, obviously get jaw pain. Um, it causes some uneasiness. Some people get ringing in the ears. So we have a simple pr procedure that we do to normalize the jaw and the way it works. So what we're going to have you do is lie on your back and we're going to just film this and just show people what we do. So Steve, we'll have you come around this way. And so what we do, come around, come around this side, is we're going to ask her to open and close her mouth and when this goes on, what, what's going to happen is I'm going to be watching to see how the jaw tracks. So go ahead. Okay, now bite down on your back teeth and then open slow. Good and close. So she's just a little bit off. Initially, when we first started treating with you, it was really bad. So now it's much better than what it was. So we're going to have you open, close. That looks pretty good. I'm going to go open again. And so now I'm actually going to treat, and I'm just going to use my finger, and I'm just going to be working on a little bit of the muscles in the back part of the jaw. It's uncomfortable, but it doesn't hurt, I would say. Okay, now close and open. Okay, good. So sometimes when we start, first start treating folks, they can't really even open their mouth fully. So the jaw is so off track that the alignment is so bad that the, that the jaw can't even unhinge. And so when we look, when somebody has a really bad condition, the jaw will kind of go back and forth like, it's kind of kind of crazy looking, but hers is much better now. So that's the treatment for TMJ. No plates, no bite guards, nothing like that, but just simple work on some muscles in the back of the jaw called the pterygoid muscles. And they're way back in here. So when we treat it, I always tell people don't bite me because you, know, you have to get near their teeth. But that's, that's where it is, it's way up in there. So very simple treatment, a little uncomfortable, but not painful. Would you say it's painful or would you say it's uncomfortable? Just a little uncomfortable. Yeah. And over time, when you do that, it normalizes the mechanics of the jaw, and then things start to do better. So initially, your pain level, what would you say your pain level was? Like an 8 or 10. It was bad. Really bad. Mm -hmm. And you had had it for a few years, so it was mm -hmm. chronic. And now with uh, treating her, we were doing mostly like a weekly treatment. It's where would you say it is here now? I mean, today it's like a two, but it's a lot better than it was. A lot less clicking, a lot less ear issues too. Right. So, so it's a very frustrating condition. I've had patients spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars on elaborate devices in their mouth and in their jaw. And it's really not necessary in most cases if we can just normalize the mechanics. So that's it. That's TMJ treatment. Um, this little technique, I call it mandible alignment technique, which is my own name for this. But this is it. That's all we do with that. All right, thanks.